In this video you will learn how to implement inside React Router multiple layouts. So this is how we typically use React Router. We simply inside our app create links and we register our routes block. And inside we have several routes like for example for slash path which is our homepage with dashboard component and then slash article slash slug with our article component and path star which means 404 if we don't have such route then not found component is being rendered. And this is how it looks like. We have here two links dashboard and our component dashboard is being rendered here. This is just a single word. I am clicking here on article and this is slash article slash foo and here we are rendering our article with dynamic parameter foo from the URL. Now the question is how we can use here multiple layouts. And actually here inside our pages I already prepared two layouts, layout 1 and layout 2. Let's open layout 1. It doesn't have anything except of h1 tag inside. Now let's say that we want to wrap the whole application with our layout. So we can write here inside our routes one more route and inside element we are simply providing our layout 1 that you just saw. And now here inside this route we want to throw everything that we have. As you can see in browser our is layout 1 is rendered but we don't have any content which actually means now this layout is being rendered for this page. What does it mean? Essentially on our route element we don't have path which actually means we are clicking on dashboard or we are clicking on our article. It simply renders this layout for this all path but with this element which is essentially correct because our layout does not have any path, we have path inside specific route. But now we must tune our layout. This is why here I will jump inside our layout and typically what we were doing previously, we were destructuring here props to get children and then we were rendering children property inside. And essentially these children are all children components which are rendered inside this route. As you can see in browser nothing is working because this is not how you should do that now. We don't need our children at all. I'm sorry for interruption but I just want to let you know that I have a membership here on the channel that you can join to support me. It will give you access to the new videos earlier, emojis and priority replies to your comments. Now let's jump back into the video. What we need to do here is to use a component which is called outlet and we are importing it from React Router DOM. And outlet is exactly the place where inside we will render our route. As you can see here in browser, article foo is being rendered. This is exactly the information that we are getting through outlet. Now I'm clicking on dashboard and here dashboard is being rendered. So if you want to use layout, you always need an outlet. Now let's do exactly the same in our layout too. So here what I want to do is render this outlet and we are good to go. Now the question is how to use multiple layouts inside our routes. And essentially now you for sure know the answer. We must wrap every single element with specific route. For example here I will wrap with the first route with layout 1, our dashboard. And then I will wrap with another route with layout 2, our article slug route. So as you can see React Router understands and collects all this path from children but our layouts don't have any path. This is completely correct and now every single route will be wrapped in specific layout. Let's have a look here. I'm clicking on dashboard, it's layout 1. I'm clicking on the article, it's layout 2. Which actually means now we can easily style specific layout for specific set of pages. For example here I can jump inside our layout 1 and apply here some styles. Let's say we have here the background and it will be chocolate. And now I want to jump inside layout 2 and here provide a style with background till. Let's have a look if it's working. As you can see we are inside articles and everything is green for us. I am jumping to dashboard and everything is orange. Which actually means we successfully implemented multiple layouts inside React Router. But are you sure that you know all features of React Router? If not, I already made a full video about React Router that you can check here.